these efforts came along. So the surge was travel. But what I want to what I want to talk about is how I over the past decade, global health has become a huge booming area. Millions of dollars are going in this field to develop new drugs and vaccines for developing countries. However, few experts claim that the media does not address this topic because of its complexity. The panel on Spotlight on Global Health, held during the World Conference of Science Journalists 2011, highlighted this issue, and the panelists also discussed the roles journalists can play to bring audiences' attention to the field of global health. So what this panel really was trying to stress is we need more attention for that and we need journalists who really look in depth, who don't just read the press releases and copy and paste, but who really uh, dig into the issue and, and look, take a critical look. A challenge for all the reporters here is to more aggressively cover what their own countries are doing to either address their own global health disease needs or to help other countries that, that don't have the means that, uh, that the wealthier countries of the world have. This is an international effort and I think a lot of journalists fail to look critically at their own countries. And After the panel, audience members raised questions and reflected on their views about global health. Um, I work at the British Medical Journal, so we do cover global health. Um, and I was just curious to see whether they'd be advocating or whether they'd be critical of global health organisations. I actually think it was really interesting. It kind of gave me a lot of food, food for thought and also places to go for kind of sources for helping to kind of unpick stories. Um, questioning big organizations and we've tried companies and I made two points about global health which I think is sort of help push um, some of the frontiers that are now being incorporated into thinking by the drug companies amongst others this is just one example one of these product development